on this computer. No. Welcome. Oh, hi. <laughs> We're recording. Um, welcome to Design Forward, everybody in formats and modalities. We are here um, today to get you started. This video is part of our weekly dispatch, which you'll get one this Monday, and we'll have another one next week. And the dispatches are just a, a kind of guide for the week. You could think of them as kind of a little mini syllabus that we put together, giving you some idea of what to look at over the course of the week, a topic to focus on, some questions that you might want to engage in, um, some selected resources, as well as activities. Um, do you want to talk about I do yeah. want to talk. <laughs> I want to say... Um, so in order to participate in DF, the expectation is that um, every weekday you will engage. So you can pick and choose from the um, weekly dispatch to decide what you wanna do each day. Some days you may only have five or 10 minutes and other days we hope you'll have a nice extended time um, to, to work with us. Um, in order to receive the stipend for Design Forward, you'll want to do um, both a daily engagement and then um, just make sure by the end, um, you have especially completed all of the annotations of the readings and the rest of the stuff you'll kind of pick and choose as as you go through. Uh, remember, if you have any questions at all, you can hook up with us in the Teams channel and we can help you or you can always just reach out to me or Martha. And one other reminder um, about the website. Make sure when you are engaging on the website that you've logged in. Um, the homepage for the module starting today will be a live version, which will show um, activity across the module by you and your fellow participants. But if you're not logged in, we can't show your activity. So make sure you're logged in when you're answering questions, when you are um, completing, well, you're going to have to be logged in to do your activities. In addition, once you're logged in, um, make sure you go to your portfolio and update your profile with an avatar, a picture. It doesn't have to be your face. It can be anything, but it is nice to see something other than gray silhouettes. Please don't use my face. I think that would be confusing. That would be strange. Um, and also update it with your hypothesis username because that allows us on that live homepage to keep track of the latest annotations. So make sure you log in and update your profile when you get a chance. If if you have any trouble with the website, please reach out to me. Teams is the quickest way to do that because I always have it open. Um, but if you prefer to email me, that's fine. You could also call me. Um, I will pick it up if the phone rings. <laughs> I've, oh, yeah. I've never called Martha, but but feel free. Um, the last thing I want to say is if you are indeed still watching this video, please reach out to me and ask me how I'm doing since this morning I hit a deer in my tiny VW bug. I will say I'm clearly still alive, but you might want to check on me. Okay, bye.